Oh. Just a real horrible... Fucking hell. Um, from the north, reaching out across the world, you're watching the Kofi Azam channel. This is Kofi. That one's Sam. And if you're here, then you are welcome. Hello, everybody. It is so lovely to see you all uh, here um, back on Twitch. At long Did last. you miss us? <laughs> I missed us. I missed I us. I did miss us last week. But you were you were living it up, running. You, I heard you ran a five k. I heard a rumor. Did run a five k. I was <laughs> voluntold into running a five k. <laughs> <laughs> um, did you go canoeing for real? Um, I, I like in I, a way out. Yes. Wow. I wasn't even getting shot at. So very similar to a way out. <laughs> um, <laughs> Did you eventually end up killing the person you were canoeing with um, after a very dramatic shootout? No, that's coming up next week. Um, oh, okay, stay uh, tuned next so, time. So, hey. you know. Um, uh, but yeah, I went to a gig. Oh, yeah. That's um, exciting. I, I saw, uh, on a whim, I, I saw a band called Spread Eagle, and they were a lot of fun. Um, nice so yeah like look up spread eagle they are exactly what they sound like they have songs with names like switchblade serenade <laughs> so that should tell that should tell you the tone um <laughs> yep that'd, um, that'd do it <laughs> yeah um but what are we here we're i'm 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 back in this seat, whatever we're calling this seat and sam's in the sam's um, in the fancy gamer that's the seat the jump seat isn't um, it the jump seat I think that's I don't, the okay, jump, jump seat. seat, hot seat, jump seat. Um, your hot seat, I'm jump seat. Um, well, what what do you want to call the seats? You know, Sam's the pilot. Sam if is. If this is the hot the seat, that's the pretty handsome seat. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> I thought you were going to go with the lukewarm seat. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we oh. are we are playing we are playing a mecha game, and Sam is going to be a mecha pilot. Indeed, I am. Um, just before we get started, a massive shout out to M and, and to, to Lady, Lady Sorche as well for subscribing. Um, M, that is 10 months. 10 months. 10 months. 10 months. Ten That's months. amazing. Thank you um, so much. And Lady Sorche for 11 months. 11 months. Oh, oh it's, a wow. it's a game of one upmanship going I on. I know. Here. I know. Um, They're just trying to, they're just trying <laughs> to outdo each other. Um, <laughs> Yeah, we are um, over here. We're playing um, Armor Core 6. How exciting. And we've got to come up with a name for our pilot. Oh. Um, and I feel do like... Do you want to go to Fantasy Name Generator, Sam? Do you want me to do that? <laughs> what, what's the sort of vibe you're going for? Um, or you, do you know, just wanna, I want something or... that... that <laughs> That sort of we're already on Bingus and Guga and Mecha Bingus. I, I feel like we need something that has Bingus energy, but more futury. So, Bongus. <laughs> oh, we're no, not no, no, calling no, no. it fucking Bongus. <laughs> <laughs> um, Bingtron, mighty defender. <laughs> Bingutron. <laughs> Bingus three thousand. <laughs> this is the name of the pilot, not the mecha. <laughs> so God knows. Uh, yeah, I like to imagine that we're playing um, an android who, you know, just happens to pilot robots. They are called oh, Bingtron three thousand. <laughs> Okay, okay. We're close to Rubicon. Wake the dog up. Oh god, who names their child Handler? Handler Walter verified. Oh, who names their child Walter? Activating uh, Mr. Control and Mrs. Softy, that's who. Walter Softy. Walter the Softy. Oh, you want to read the Beano? <laughs> yeah. yeah. It took me a minute. I, I haven't heard a Beano reference in... A good Time number of years. Uh, no, because um, 
on Saturday I had lunch with my friend from Dundee and we were talking about the Desperate Dan statue they've got there. Uh, I'm not Desperate Dan's not Beano, but like he's Dandy, it's the same. It's the same publisher. Wait, were they up in Aberdeen? No, no they're Dundee. Oh. Did I say Aberdeen? Nope. Nope. I'm just... Oh. Oh, this is very loud. What? What? Did they accidentally blow up the satellite dishes? I think that might have been deliberate. Ah. I'm very unclear on what's going on. Oh, oh. That's a mecca. So we're going to build the most disgusting looking mecca with whatever options we have, right? And well, just customize it to look the most gross as we go along. You, you saw the picture I sent you, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> disgusting. And yet very um, on brand for this channel. Did, you know, it's our channel colors. The worst part is I made it more ugly after that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Sam, Sam did a little because this is this is a new game, um, like newly released. So I think Sam, you did like a short record to check it was running. Use it to close the gap. Because there's a lot. Funnily enough, it's a lot of processing power from a computer to play this game and stream it at the same time. Yeah. No, I just wanted to make sure that. My computer wasn't going to combust. And so, sorry, speaking of which, I should do a oh. thing. Um, Overclocking, <laughs> overclock work. That is still not what that is, but yeah. Okay. It's overclocking, I've decided. <laughs> You've just got an overclock button. Uh, um. My Boy. desktop has an overclock button that doesn't do anything, <laughs> <laughs> um, which I love. Um, so, just to give me a... Do you know what the scale of this mecha is? Like, is it... Where okay, does the pilot sit? So. Is the pilot just in the head? Is no. it that big or is it... Um, I don't think so, because... Okay, if you look, we're 550 meters away from something. As we okay. walk, you know, we go pretty fast. Yeah. But you know, you know. I mean, this one room is a kilometer along, though. That that's big. Okay, so no, the so scale. We can, can see, see the walkway there, right? You can see this walkway. That's a person-sized walkway, right? I I would hope so. Um. um so it is definitely a big robot. So, Definitely but, like, a big robot. It's not so big that there's one person just in the helmet thing of the mecha. It's probably sitting... Okay, yeah, I mean, it's it's a big guy, but it's not the biggest guy. We're not talking like Warhammer 40,000 here. We can compare it to these stairs. So, like, yeah, there's probably room for one person, but probably not. Yeah. Oh, Sam, you ran out of jetpack. Oh, man. You fucked up, and you fell, and it didn't fuck your mecha up either. I mean... Oh. Oh. EN stands for energy, guys. Wait, is that what it said? Yeah. EN oh, brackets energy. Spent the whole, like, three hours I was playing the other day trying to figure out what EN meant. <laughs> well, now you know. The more you know... Oh. Oh, I have one of them. I should remember I have one of them. Oh, was that was that a cutty cutty? <gasps> That's an energy oh. sword. Oh my god, it's just like Metal Gear Solid Rising. <sighs> Actually, it's Metal Gear Rising. Oh, shut up. It was meant to be Metal Gear Solid Rising before <laughs> they restarted development. Wow, those guys didn't even know you were there. That's just cold-blooded. What even were they? Um, I think they were big robots. Well, they're very small pieces of big robots now. Yep. And you'll never guess what this is. Because it's a fucking train. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Straight in there with our train. Straight in there with our Straight train. Straight in there with our train. <laughs> um... 
Oh, speaking of which, the um, the uh, the band, the the support bands last week was a band called Tram Surfer, and they are really cool. Unfortunately, they are not on Spotify, so it's hard to listen up, uh, look them up, and listen to them. But they were really cool. And when I messaged uh, when I messaged Tim about them, uh, Tim Ledson, um, he was jealous because he likes bands that are all about trams and trains. Yeah. Funnily enough, Tim likes trains. So a little second ago, if... Uh, If they explained it, I missed it on the chat feed, but um, I think M on chat was saying there's only one thing that is bigger than a Warhammer 40,000 Titan. Um, and yeah, uh, I would love to know what is bigger than a Warhammer 40,000 Titan. Um, you know, at this point I can, I can just make a really tasteless joke. Well, Obviously, it? it's your mum. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Uh. oh my god. Oh my god. Flowers love for everyone here is what's bigger than a Warhammer 40,000 Titan. Oh. Isn't that sweet? I like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you just destroyed that train by walking next to it. Did you see that? Your AC's taken damage. Oh no, that's not a train. That's... What does AC? Does AC stand for... Uh, oh, armor core. core. Okay, not air conditioning. Uh, no, weirdly enough, it's not air conditioning. <laughs> well, you would hope this thing is air conditioned. I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah, it seems quite uncomfortable, if not... Um... Assassin's Creed... Your Assassin's Creed has taken damage. Um, That's true. It's not. It's not what it once was. That is part <laughs> of my problem. Is I can only only see AC as Assassin's Creed. Um, like when people were talking about Animal Crossing a lot, um, my brain just automatically connected. <gasps> sorry, the, sorry. I just want to enjoy this fucking rail moment. Like, look. Oh my god. This and is why Mecha I love Mecha has anime. become the train. I just, I just love Mecha launch sequences in anything. Yeah. Sorry, I interrupted oh. you. Um, we'll make a killing. Plenty for a merc with a fried brain like you to buy their life back. That's fucking rude, Handler Walter. I, you know, I don't Shut mock up, you. I don't mock you for having the first name Handler. <laughs> so you shouldn't. You shouldn't mock us for our personal issues. Scavenge the AC Rex ahead. Find a valid mercenary license. We're illegals here. You'll need ID to operate. Yeah, no, tram surfers. I have tried to track down tram surfers music. Um, Lorelei. Um, unfortunately. I don't know, I think, I think they were student bands, to be fair, like, they just may not have gotten around to recording. But, they absolutely should, like, genuinely. They were like a funk prog trio, um... Genuinely oh, yeah. some, some of the coolest bass stuff play. about bass yeah. that yeah, I did like, not understand. Good god, they were amazing. <laughs> um... No, it's the sort of thing that makes that makes someone like me look at like my base skills and go like, oh, what the fuck am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> In the best possible way. Oh my god, you're just showing up at a place where people live and just fucking. No, this this just is fucking very murdering specifically people. the contaminated city where it, it's just mercenaries roaming around. Oh. Keep a low profile. You don't want them breathing down our necks. Got a little bit of slow down there. Extract the pilot data. 
Oh. You're gonna forge your identity? Yeah. So you can get to drink at the Mecca bar? <laughs> so we can be a... be a... Mercenary. Oh, that one didn't work. Two repair kits remaining. Whoa. Uh -oh. That's the AC from the report. Find out who they're working. Analyzing. So who's the RLF? Because they seem to be the guys you're shooting up. Ooh. Well, your name's Thomas Kirk now, not uh, not Bingus Tron. <laughs> <laughs> No, that license was expired. Oh. Keep looking. Much like the pilot, one has to assume. Oh, oh, very nicely. Deduced. I mean, they could have just left it. They could have just gone like, you know what, I'll get a different mecha. This one sucks. Oh, that shield wasn't much good, was it? Not compared to my energy sword. Oh, lucky this helipad was here. <laughs> yeah, in a world where, like, there are all these mecha, who flies a helicopter? <laughs> oh, we need to build you some kind of module that lets you fly longer. Yeah, it would be nice. Oh, <sighs> So, yeah, I guess what we haven't said, because we loaded straight into this, this is a From Software game. Yeah. Um, it is, as you may 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 have noticed, um, a, not not quite as souls likey. It it has a bit more of an arcade feel to it. So I will say that. Um, very. Cavalier makes a good point. Maybe the helicopters are the classic cars of this setting. You know, there's a part of me that's surprised that you have fine ass ammunition. Yeah. Like, it, you know, it makes sense, and I think it's more interesting this way. Um, but it does, especially because it's, there's, I don't know, as I understand it, there's quite a lot of, like, building and optimization sides of this game. But there is a part of me that goes like, huh, you don't have infinite ammo in your weapons. Yeah. Right, one of these guys has got to have a good idea. Registration number RB23. Rank fits the bill. Call sign. What? Ooh, that is a big gunship. Oh my, you just look at his health bar. Oh wait, is that not his health bar? Oh. oh. I thought I thought you nearly killed it, but I must oh. be looking at the wrong thing. No, I barely barely scratched it. <laughs> so what was the what was the yellow thing? Oh Is uh, that its poison meter or is this second? Yeah, stag no, it's, li it's, it's literally his poison meter. Huh. Yeah. Flower suggesting if you if you make pupil noises enough, the bullet holes will placebo themselves into the mechas on their own. That's exciting. Pew pew pew. Yeah, I should have repaired my health. That's it. Try oh well. That's all right. You got more repair kits than you had before. You're literally being rewarded for dying. I know, but now I won't get S rank, which matters to me a lot. It doesn't. That's lucky because. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I too do love looting corpses and fraud. Oh right, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You need to loot the corpse before I you fight the boss. I need to loot the corpse, don't I? That 
That's silly, isn't it? Clearly, this is a sting, though, because they only show up after you loot the corpse. Like, they're waiting for you. They clearly placed this here. Yeah. I get shooting. Looks like they were on to you after all. In no mood to pick a fight with the PCA. Well, it doesn't matter. Take it out now, they won't have enough to ID you. Oh right, not now I see what's actually it. Is. <gasps> Oh wow, if you survive for more than a couple of seconds, he actually gives you advice. <laughs> yeah. So that's fun. Oh boy. You got BD1 to give you some uh, the health kit there. Oh boy. <sighs> How easy is it to get behind it? Um, it's alright when he's inbounds, but. Currently, he is too far away for me to get at him. Halfway there. Uh, Kaplan is reminding you to say pew pew pew. I can oh. do it for you if you like. Pew 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 Oh, look at it! Look at it stagger! Oh. Do you get a glory kill if you fill it up? When you when you ran out of energy to fly, that that fucked you there. Yeah. Right at the end. My God. And can you imagine what this boss would be like in any other from software game? <laughs> <laughs> can you imagine this in Dark Souls? <laughs> just, just the chosen undead stood there with the sword sort of on his back and just surfaced <laughs> as sort of missiles just raining down on him. I mean, yeah, you don't want to be fat rolling then, do you? Exactly. It's okay, because we'll steal parts from this guy when, when you kill him and we'll make, a, we'll make more mech. Oh, you got roller skates! Oh. Yeah, I got rocket skates. Oh, I love it. Yeah, you see, like, under there is really good because there's no gun that can actually point itself at you. Oh, it's staggered! Fuck yeah! Yeah, you do a lot more damage when it's scared. Oh my god, you're basically back to where you were. Yeah. No, getting Woo. the stagger off is, is really good. It's sort of hard to pull off sometimes, but... So have you played one of these before? Um, or no, is this just from your... your th this is just trip? from my, my, my bit of a recce. Because there's, there's a bunch of these, right? Like, I know this is six, but there have been way more than six. Like, this oh. is the sixth one with a number. Oh, come on, Sam. Uh. No, I wasn't keeping an eye on my health. My bad. 
Um, you had that. You had that, and you let it slip yeah. through your fingers. Don't worry. I'll have it this time. Um, <laughs> did you remember to pick up your souls? <laughs> This is a Michael Bay movie. It's it's really cool though. Except it's easier <laughs> to follow the action. <laughs> oh. I tried um, rewatching Bad Boys Two a couple of months ago, and it is just it would be a good film. It's just all the action sequences are so badly shot that you can't actually see what's happening. Oh no. Like, you know that kind of mid 2000s thing? Yeah! Oh! Yeah! Oh! Love it. Uh, I'm sorry, cool fingers by his new cool sign that he just got, not 621 or whatever. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Oh. Man, I want a laser sword. <sighs> yeah, laser swords are just cool. Oh boy. Confirmed. Heavy combat helicopter is down. That's all for our work You call today. that a heavy helicopter? Here's the call sign for that license you picked up. Well, it's not a light helicopter. It's not a helicopter. <laughs> <laughs> The call sign that he made a big deal about. It's Raven. Oh. Yeah, I Raven. No idea. Should have been <laughs> should have been Google. Name here on Rubicon. Oh Rubicon's the planet. Okay. Yeah. And we get a hundred and twenty grand for that. I'd like 120 grand for watching cool. you play one level of Sega <laughs> again. I'll, I'll, I'll be alright with that. Discovered on Rubicon, a planet on the frontier of developed space. For a time, oh, now we get some context. Was a revolutionary energy resource. Oh, so we're after the unobtainium. Ah, uh, yes. They called it the fires of Ibis. A storm of flame that tore through the stars, leaving lethal contamination in its wake. And that's why no one lives in the city. Coral, the kindling, was thought to have been utterly consumed, forever lost. Oh no, the Unobtainium exploded. However, that's, uh, that's on Rubicon, the embers continued to burn. There's still some on the Rubicon. God, From the Software will not just let return. it be with the fucking embers, huh? Right. Yeah, like they just Still fucking love a good ember. They <laughs> love a good ember. <laughs> That's just the way it's gotta be. But this is the most exciting bit. Registration but, number. Because oh, now we get to design our mech. Call sign yeah. Authentication complete. Removing MIA status. Restoring access privileges. This is All Might, the mercenary support system. Welcome back, Raven. Oh, thanks. That's nice to be back inside of you, All Mind. Looks like you passed the authentication. Now Raven. he's got a cool emblem. That's who you are now. Yeah, You're no, like gun. puppet strings. Do you reckon he's the big bad? Already. He's Take the big look, bad, right, one. Walter the Softy? He might be the big bad. Yeah. This notification follows restoral of access privileges. All Mind provides a combat training simulator to support its mercenaries. So if you just gone to the base of the people state, you just exploded you and they're like, yeah, come in. 
It's good to see you after so long. I think we've gone to like a mercenary base. Wait, so who were you fighting before? I don't really You've know. just killed their helicopter and then you've gone and now you live with them? <laughs> Basically. Because <laughs> no, you're I... pretending to be a mecha that doesn't look like you in any way, but you fooled the computer. <laughs> is that is that what's happened? Huh. Right. We don't okay. have any spare parts, but... You can you, paint them. You can see what what we will have access to. And now, the really important part. So... It's making us look <laughs> properly disgusting. Corporate? We have the three, the three genders, corporate, military, and dark. <laughs> you know, we can... We can go with one of these, which, you know... Cavalant has ventured the opinion that the helicopter we just destroyed had great birthing hips. And I am confused. But that's okay. I, I don't need to understand everything. Cavalant, don't make me time you <laughs> out. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> now, you can see you can see the potential here, right? But oh, there's a, oh the there we go. You see what I said on Twitter is just like you picked a Splatoon mecha. But that yeah. is the cover to yeah. Splatoon 3. <laughs> um, now, I think the very important part is that you should just also model this as well. You can, you can put camouflage on it. Oh, that is full zebra. That is full zebra. Um, oh, there's a QR code option. As some very good, good options oh, here. The flames. This weird, like trippy oh, oil oh, slick. Oh no, that uh, that that's um, very persona. Stars. <laughs> Little pluses. Um. Flames. Just so we go faster. The thing is, there are so many different sources. Uh, sorry, so many different, um, I guess, surfaces on this design that no matter what you do, it all kind of looks the same. If that makes sense, there's no like overall. Right. Yes. So, um, obviously, if we if we. <laughs> 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 so we can pick this, right? Which just gonna make us blend in. Um, no one will ever see you coming. You'll be a silent death from. No above. one will ever see us coming. Um, but do you want to see the even more disgusting part? Um, you you can do each part of each body part separate. <laughs> Oh, can you can you make so, it look like we're in a tank top and just have our guns out? <laughs> so, can you make can you make the arms flesh? <laughs> um. <laughs> no, I, that that is that does make it look like that arm is just off a different <laughs> robot. Um. So anyway, uh, chat. I think we need like three or four, three or four main colours. <laughs> I think. I think. I I do wanna I do wanna throw back to um to the Sonic Forces. I do want like a flesh coloured appendage, um like the flesh hands <laughs> and the flesh feet. Since we love those so much, <laughs> but we got a request for trans flag um for a merry Chris. Oh, we've already got a merry Christmas one. Um, okay. Oh, you can't do the individual legs. No, oh, you that's can't. A pity. It is a shame. Um, now, what can we get that's like? How do I get fleshier oh, we, than we've, this? We've 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 been recommended a a hex code for a color that I think we should try. So oh, that is four B. Um, I I only have R G B. Can oh, you no. translate okay, that yeah, to R G B? Okay. <laughs> Hex RGB on it. 
Uh, guys, stop talking on the hex codes because it's about to disappear off the, <laughs> off the thing. 4BEC13. 4BEC13. BEC13. Okay, you can talk again. Hex to RGB. Um, okay, so you want 29... Oh, it's, it's not in percentages, is it? Um, not really, but I can figure it out. So, we're wanting... Uh, it says 29.41% red. Right. Um, you good with that? Uh, close this, uh, this, enough. Uh, this, uh, this uh, better be good, Lorelei. Uh, okay, 92.5% green. Okay. And 7.5% blue. Okay, how do I get bluier from here? Um, right. How much? 7.45%. You got it all the way down. Um, apparently, if we've got it right, it's pink. So, oh. Oh, oh right. no, sorry, sorry. That's a different, that's a different one. That's a diff different suggestion. Um... <laughs> Right, because it wasn't very much blue. Oh no, it's just it's just an extremely green green. Um, oh, it's an extremely green green. Oh, that's a pretty good green. That's a pretty is, good green. It is like you are playing five different games of Splatoon at once. <laughs> um, it is. And a, what do we want for the secondary fest. color here? Um, um, what goes well with a with a green? Um, Oh, now that that that's Splatoon two. So your torso is Splatoon three, and your bottom half is Splatoon two. <laughs> yeah. I'm 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 digging it. I'm digging it. It's disgusting. <laughs> but we're bringing some color to this, frankly, very gray and drab world. So, right. Okay, I think I'm we need... I'm actually going to take this pattern off to can... see if we can just get it close enough to flesh. How... how, how... The, the other suggestion would be, for me, um, just actual black and white leopard prints. Oh. Um, that's pretty good. You can you can choose the shininess. Oh, oh yeah. Um, oh. Right. We've got a preset, which is there but once it's, it's on the robot enough. it doesn't like look fleshy no it doesn't look very fleshy so first things first let's completely take the weathering off good plan um, i love that there's this depth to this <laughs> i know and by the way every individual component can be stripped out and replaced i believe um is the gameplay loop of this <sighs> Right, so that needs to go like. Um, needs to go. You know what the shade that's like? That's like a that's like a towel. Oh, walker. I can just Since select RGB. Oh, damn it! Right, sorry. Oh, um, I thought that's what you were doing. I'm not being paying close enough attention. Um, I I was trying to. Um. It's not quite fleshy, is it? No, like I think maybe tweaking the finish or like making it such a matte finish would do it. But I, you know, I'm not getting big, like flesh from it. But I do like how like drab it is compared with literally everything else being insane. But I would be interested in I would be interested in a zebra pattern. Um you know? Right. Until until we can come up with something better, here's here's the flesh arm. <laughs> um, <laughs> or flam. We'll we'll 
we'll get back to it. Don't worry. Yeah, we, uh, you know, there's a long game ahead of us. We're gonna. There's be, a uh, long game ahead. There's so many more flams to make. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the first rule of medicine: do no flam. <laughs> um. Uh, we're being asked, can the head be uh, can the head be patterned separately from the torso? Yes. Okay. <laughs> so what's the head gonna be? So is the head with the one we go for with uh, black and white? Potentially. Um, or a request for pumpkin, which I quite like, just a really garish orange. Oh, pumpkin's quite good. <laughs> Uh, I'm I'm sorry. This will be the entire game. Um, I am. Oh, one hundred percent. That's what I'm signed up for. I don't know about anyone else. Um, right? Because no, we could kill the <laughs> ship. <laughs> See, that's what I was talking about. Um, yeah, that's that's pretty good. And then. <laughs> so stupid. It's so stupid. They're like, "Welcome back. You were MIA." Something happened. What happened to you? You used to be normal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do you um, want to make his? Do you want to make his torso pumpkin colored? Well, that's oh, what. Oh, now we're talking. So. <gasps> oh, that's actually quite cool. Is the thing. Um. I mean, we're allowed to go with cool. I I feel like we need to. What what pattern do you reckon most embodies pumpkin? Um, wait, you gotta go through them slower than that. Okay. Not so that one, because that's too, that's too dark. That's close, because you've got, like, the angular things that look like they've cut eye holes and things. Um, but you want the dominant color to be yeah. orange. Um. 18 was not bad. For me, it's between 18 and 28 so far. Now that's Minecraft pumpkin. That's true. <laughs> um. Ooh, I quite like fifteen. And quite like so fifteen. Jazzy, you know. <laughs> um. And a jazzy, jazzy mecca. Ooh, that's hurting my Tw eyes. Twelve might be my favorite. <laughs> that's hurting my eyes, which means it's an immediate favorite. <laughs> I like how they've got like zebra and then pixelated zebra right next to each other on yeah. seven and eight. <laughs> oh, because the first one was a PS1 game. Are they trying to like appease the PS1 fans? No, I think this is just the way that camouflage is designed. Huh. <laughs> um, I don't know. I think 12. Yeah. Um, now... We can. <laughs> this is how granular it goes. We can change the size of this pattern. <laughs> um. Pumpkin. So, like, you got the body is the pumpkin, the legs are the spice, and the flesh arm is the latte. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. What earth we wrought. Ah. <laughs> uh. You know, we've made more disgusting stuff. Um, so then, but you know, it's pretty disgusting. Three bean soup. Uh, sorry, we are. M says three bean soup. Oh, we can color the guns in. <laughs> okay, the guns are the guns are trans guns. Oh no, one sorry, one gun is one gun is yellow and purple because those are our channel colors. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Oh, ho, ho, ho. is that is that the trans gun? We need to get we need to get like the darker pink into some blue. That's, I think. I think that's more the um, lesbian pride flag uh, gun. But oh boy, I just love it. Um, right, let's see what we can do. Yeah, I think so we need to switch this support bit with needs device. To be, yeah, can we, can we not blue. just swap out? Like, just actually swap them out. As in, like, take the color for device, which is the blue we're going for, and swap it to where support is. Um, wait, what? Go back to the screen you had before. Um, 
Det är ja, um. We don't know. No, no. Right. Let's. Okay, we can't okay. do that. Oh yeah. Okay. So, can you see device? Yeah. That's the color we want in support. So, can we not just swap them? Um, I'm not sure that you can. But what four we Four six can do one six is six two five five. Um, copy that there. Ooh. Four um. six. One six six two five five, and there. No, that was that was wrong. That was wrong. It was wrong. Oh, oh boy. It was wrong. Sorry. What did you say? Four, Four six. six. One six six. Two five five. Oh no, that's not that's not quite right. Yeah, it's it's. It's got to be slightly lighter. A, yeah, no, it is a paler blue. Yeah, oh, I love it though. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? What do we think? It reminds us of old times with our our, our BD8 um, our BD8 skin. Oh yeah. And our poncho to match. What do uh, we reckon, chat? Does that look pretty good? <laughs> um. Right. And do you want to? This yeah, see. we can. Yeah, you you want you want your classic Waluigi color scheme. Um. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Let's let's go for that on there. This is beautiful. The, this back unit will do our colors. <laughs> so um, that is. We're just honoring so many things. <laughs> Cavalan, what do you mean this isn't good? <laughs> <laughs> What are you talking about? This is not only good, this is the best. Um, right. Oh, thank you. Thank you for clarifying. It's not good, it's great. <laughs> Perfect, even. <laughs> right. Um. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Just imagine, this is going to be the last thing that all the other armored units see. <laughs> <laughs> it's the very last <laughs> fight. <laughs> okay, now we blend in perfectly. Do you know what this is, though? Do you remember um, Power Rangers, where they all had like their individual mecha that fused into one oh, massive no. one? Whoops. But each segment had a different like, color because it was a different person's mecha originally? It's that. This is the Power Rangers Megazord. Save the edits. <laughs> it's wonderful to just see it in the game world as well. Um, I th uh, oh, how do Can I you upload decals? Oh, oh no, because then people just have dicks, right? Um, I don't think you can upload decals. Uh, you can make your own, but like... Oh, so people just have whole... dicks, but you need to be dedicated to it. Yeah. Um... I, I I feel like we've spent long enough. I think it's fine. Like we 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 don't need to we don't need to wear someone's logo on our fashion. No. Oh my god. Right. I'm doing right, some training, training because I love how they, they let they... you paint a mecha before they train you. <laughs> <laughs> and the worst part is you can't even do training in your own mech. Uh, so, oh, so we don't even sake. get to see it yet. Because I have to assume that that paint job we just did cost hundreds of thousands of dollars. <laughs> <laughs> um, did we spend forty minutes doing that? No, we spent no. we spent fifteen twenty minutes um, doing it's that. Still a lot of time, <laughs> but you know what? It's worth it. You got you gotta you gotta make sure these things are just right. Why are they telling you how to reload now? You just killed a helicopter. If it was a helicopter, which it wasn't. It I know you can't go shots. I, 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 any time we spend customizing the mecha, it's time well spent. To me, that's why I'm here. I want to, I want to get granular with the mecha parts, like both, both because the paint job is funny, but also, I'm really excited for Sam building the best mecha. Um, oh boy. 
like just from a mecha fan perspective. I mean, you almost hit it. All right, now it's dead. I didn't even see you kill it. What do you do? Uh, I shot rockets at it. Uh, that's unsportsmanly. Oh, boy. I love to kill mechs with a mech. <laughs> Just nice and fun, wholesome content. <sighs> okay, the important part is now we get to go out in the field. <laughs> so oh, no, we got a new gun, we got a new gun to paint. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Howard. Right. I'm just saying that, you know, if I could have painted the individual bits of Samus, that game would have... <laughs> that version of Metro Prime would have been perfect. And also taken five more episodes. <laughs> of course. <laughs> I'm waiting to unlock the baseball cap that says Game Over. Oh, I can't wait till we unlock that with our mech. The Rubicon Liberation Front has deployed biosar artillery throughout the contaminated city. I believe that's what the city RLF is no that we were value. fighting in the city. Allow them to what an what of the was the name of the city before it was contaminated? Show us your ambition. Uh, Cove. <laughs> Uh, it was actually oh, always the contaminated city. It's it's even just, when things were fine. <laughs> yeah, it, it's just a case of like a uh, nominative determinism. <laughs> um, <laughs> they just just fate saw that and was like, oh well, better 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 get on that then. Better get on the contamination. Yeah. If they fix it, does it become the decontaminated city? <laughs> Absolutely I just, not. I just need to know. Who does this job? I love how seriously you're taking this when my mech looks like that. <laughs> oh. Well, you know, like he's out of his comfort zone. You have to like... <laughs> he needs to just, you know... This is weird, but hey, business as usual. We just trust that, trust that this pilot, Bingus, knows what he's doing. <laughs> oh, this... Genuinely just cheers up this world so much. Right. Like, being deliberately stupid aside, I am so much for this bright color scheme. Can you get away with just ignoring these guys? They don't seem to be hurting you. Uh, yeah, but on this mission specifically, I get more money for killing more of them. Okay. So. No, you can't. Oh! Nice. Oh, that gun is so good! Oh my god! It's amazing. Oh. How come they're building all these mecha with no health? Uh, like, if we've got I've this mecha that's so I've much... just got infinite health. Damage. Like, I'm just... Well, you've clearly got a mecha that's just head and shoulders better than any of the other individual mecha. 
Which hey, is like, maybe if I'm you just have a-, a really great pilot. Did you think of that? <laughs> I did, and then I discounted it. <laughs> <laughs> Brutal. Well, I mean, clearly you're going through basic training, or maybe it's induction training, like when you start a new job and you have to learn, you know. No, that's what they said it was. The data protection yep. policy and stuff, even though you know it. Like, I guess they think you've worked for them before, is the thing. But I'm just saying, if you've got access to this mecha that is head and shoulders above all the other mecha here, why, why do you need to take these jobs? For or are money? you just in debt from buying this? There you go, some peace and quiet now. I love you dumb looking mech. This is so good. <laughs> we need a better name than Raven though. What are you talking about? We're entirely black. We're so stealthy. <laughs> So, why are we murdering the Freedom Fighters? Uh, because someone paid us, is paying us to. Well, that's not very nice of us, or them. No, we're not a good person. <laughs> what do you mean? This is a FromSoft game. <laughs> armor at me. Ooh, I think you need to be using more cover. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, uh. Don't worry, I think... Yeah, yeah, you got it. You got it. Um, is it me or is that move a bit hard to control? It's all right when I've remembered to put the lock on on. Okay. <laughs> gotcha. I like how in the world them itself there is just an invisible wall that pops up red when you approach it. Oh. oh. Okay. Oh, dear. Ah. Should have, should have put on that different gun. Yeah, but this gun just looks so good with that paint Pain job. Activating combat mode. Commence mission. Destroy all of the Rubicon Liberation Front's artillery placements. See, now these are helicopters. Yeah, they seem more like what I'd expect a helicopter to be. I've got a question. What are these floating structures that are above the city? Are they more city? Um, that's the place I was before. Yeah. I don't really know, but it's got a lot of trains. So, so it can't be all bad. like a hit and run approach you're not wrong but like then how will I make money when you come back and hit them again <laughs>
I love how much damage that does when it connects. Yeah. Does it have a cooldown? Um, yeah, you can see after I do it, um, uh, down in the bottom right where my uh, ammo is, it says overheat. And okay. it needs a cooldown. Cool. It's a literal cooldown. Nice. I mean, I'm fully not keeping track of the, uh, the HUD on this. Right, where was I going? I'm going over there. You guys are the blue, the blue diamond. The Blymond? Blymond. I think I knew a guy called Blymond once. <laughs> That was actually his name, um, Rip Ciso. Nice. Oh, 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 don't. Get the one at yeah. the back now. No, I've got so much more health than I did last time. I'm in a much better position. If, my, if I let my boost recover. Alright, get into cover. Yes! <laughs> Love it. That's it for this job, 621. Return to base. <laughs> Return to base via smashing into literally every wall you can find on the way. Oh, is it just gonna. Oh, it's gonna fade out. See, I we got, got 48 extra grand from killing stuff. We got paid so much less than we did for just finding one fake ID. No, we got lot. like 120 from the what? mission, but we got yeah. less okay. Yeah, but we got less this time. Oh, I I'm just saying we did more and got paid less. Which this ain't that true of the current job market. We've noticed. Restoring access to oh. Actually, my, um, my call sign is uh, Bingy. <laughs> Bingy. Bingu. Heart shop. And now here's, shit. here's where stuff we really just gotta goes get off. A pistol. Oh, <laughs> what is that? So, bazooka is a bazooka. Um, I, I, I presume it fires really slowly, but you can see how much extra. Um, uh, oh, the damage is the insane. The attack power and impact is. You only um, have 78 for the mission. Yeah. So, um, I'm sort of tempted by this because it, like, doubles my attack power, but, mm. um... That seems like the safest bet of the three, but... But we could... We can see. Um, so, in this hand, this <laughs> is two guns. currently the one that I've got my um sword I like that in. it auto paints them though. Yeah. Um I th think I really like the sword, so I'm I want to keep the sword for now. Have you checked the stats of the one that you unlocked for free after the training? 
Oh, uh, against the one you actually have, or the ones you're considering buying? No, I didn't. Oh, that looks like it might be shy. So it's got a whole bunch more rounds, but it doesn't do much damage. So they say nah. you should like dual wield it. And I don't really want to dual wield guns at the moment because I think the sword's really powerful. So oh, I would be I would be away with the dual wielding. Um. So. I think we could get some more. Some I like that. They look like missiles. they look like little Nerf packs. <laughs> <You know? laughs> um, or we could get missiles on the other side, or a shield. Ooh. But like, let's be honest. From and we don't currently order, have something in that place right now, right? No. Okay. From fallen order, I wouldn't use the shield. <laughs> Did we have a shield in Fallen Order? Maybe. I forget. I don't think we had I a shield in Fallen Order. You used Force Putsch a lot. That's true. Um, oh. What are these changing? Uh, the head. Oh no, I mean like, what, so what stats do they change? You can see they give us more health uh -huh. which is AP armor points. Um, well, some of them give you more health, some of them give you less, but um, also like decrease your weight and stuff. Um, uh, let's see. <laughs> we can go really bulky on this. We Shonky. might want to save up for like a. It depends how much you want to fly, really. Like. Do you do you think you are a quick nippy guy or do you think you're a tanky guy? Um, well, if we want to be a quicker nippier guy, we can get some boosters. Boosters always a good shout. I presume. I, I have <laughs> literally no idea. I I have no idea. I I, I don't really know, but. Um, I mean, the thing is, if you start like clearly, the money comes pretty fast and easy in this game. Like, I'm going um, if you for don't some like it, like boosters, and we can we can see how we feel. You're not gonna upgrade your weapons? Um, not right now. I, I'm gonna save up some money. Okay. I uh, might get a big bulky chest. <laughs> um, to to make you look more like a pumpkin. Yeah. You know. Um. Uh, Chatter talking a lot about mud. Just big in, big into the mud this week, chat. Uh, big into the mud. Some concern has been raised about the. <laughs> don't understand what's happening. Chat have been playing in mud. Oh, this is what I've gleaned. Are you at least eating worms like Phil and Lil from the Rugrats? Mm. To all independent mercenaries, this request comes from Schneider of the Archivist Group. The operation will take place in Grid 135, Southern Bellius. <gasps> Not Grid 135. Destroy an MT squad sent by Dafung, a Balaam company, and a competitor. Um, <laughs> 21st century clan says, of course we were eating worms. Yes. To conduct a coral survey in the contaminated city. You, the independent mercenaries, are the key to maintaining our lead in the coral survey race. The archivist group looks forward to news of your success. This guy sounds so yuppy. Briefing over. And happy hunting. Um, briefing over. I thought you said breathing I'm, over. I was like, that's harsh. Um... See, I I hear him, and he reminds me. We've not me been paying. Day. We've not been paying chat enough attention, so they're playing in the mud. Oh, I see. I see. Um, it sounds like they're having fun in the mud, though. So. Are you having fun in the mud? <laughs> Jan's um, here. Hi, Jan. Oh. They're not having fun in the mud. Oh no.
I'm sorry, I'm just I, I'm distracted by Mecha and the beautiful creation. Activating combat mode. Uh see his his Dawson sort of posh voice board. makes me makes me think of um the uh, The Archivus guy? No, the priest guys from Fallout. Um, the 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 Battlehood of Steel, the yeah. Brotherhood of Steel. Yeah, those guys. Chatter feral children left to defend. Left to defend for them to fend for themselves. Like, yeah, we're not we're not putting them up against wolves. They don't have to defend themselves. They just need to fend for themselves. They need to find the worms. They need to find the worms. They need to find the worms. The really good worms for Schlopin. Just, just just the juiciest worms. What's the thing? Like, is there, there's a trick you can do to, like, trick worms into coming to the surface. And I can't remember what it is. Something to do with vibrations? Yeah, you like, can... You can... Vibrate the ground. You can put a vibraphone, right? A vi right like a vibraphone? Like a marimba? Yeah, uh, yeah. Really okay. <laughs> But where are they? Someone's shooting at you, but they clearly can't see you. There we go. Oh. Oh. Whee. <laughs> I'd be interested to know would you be fine? Would you just go down to the city and have to fly back up? I mean, I kind of know you wouldn't. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm just really distracted. I just really like Mecha. Um, this is... Oh boy, I... I am having a lot of fun with this game. Why are we just jumping to elimination and wipe them out and it's like, why can't we just reason with them? Just say, come join our side, we have the funkiest designs. We do have the funkiest designs. You know, like, I just feel like your... I feel like your mecha designs could use a little bit of livening up. You're going so industrial and, like... Yeah, it's <sighs> just, you know, have some fun with it, you know? Sure, you're in a military dystopia, but... That Yum. felt like the difficulty curve on these three missions is off a little bit, right? <laughs> oh, I guess you got paid only a little bit though. Yeah, no. It's like a like a side quest. One new message. You can learn everything you need in life from trans girls on Tumblr. <laughs> Registration number RB twenty three. Call sign. Raven, your records have been updated. 
You have also been granted access to participate in the log hunt program. Oh, yeah, we're going to find those logs. We're going to hunt them logs. Oh, I'm not, I mean, oh, God, they mean data logs, All not literal logs. <laughs> I was like, we're going to find the one tree that's still growing on this planet. And we're going to log it. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, can you buy yourself spider legs? I really want there to be spider legs in this game. Hey, what 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 your leg options? Ooh. Ooh. Uh, that second one are... is working on its core. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh armored God. core. It's just got the biggest baggiest trousers. Oh, look at those thighs. <gasps> those are some chicken drumsticks right there. <laughs> like, oh. I'm oh. hungry now. <laughs> I looked at a mecca and felt hungry. Um, I, yeah, I, I that, love that how is very cool. They they're very good. No, uh, good points. M points out no ass on the one with the thighs. So, oh, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't look at the, I didn't yeah. look at the ass. Oh, oh yeah, it's, a, uh, it's got some ass, but not not in proportion it's not, to the thighs. Yeah, it's 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 not the dumper it needs, that these it, thighs deserve. It, it needs a real <laughs> badonka donk. <laughs> oh boy. Um, what are we gonna go with? Um, I'm I I think I'm still gonna save up for like a. A fancy core. <laughs> Cavalin is like, okay, so we can talk about the ass, but we can't talk about the birthing hips on the helicopter. <laughs> 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 we appreciate yeah, you, Em. <laughs> yes, you're correct. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right, let's... Let's do some training because they give us parts for the training and at the very least we can sell them. <laughs> Emp oh. um. did send us snacks. It was unbelievably sweet. And really, really good coffee. Are we doing the same training? Um, no, we're doing slightly different training. We've got some different weapons. Uh, this one charges up <gasps> and does a special shot. Oh! I quite like that. Oh! Liking this gun. <laughs> how, how much ammo do you? Oh, yeah, I have 120. So I've got 120 rockets on my shoulder, okay. and I've got. Oh, right, the, the boss wants the gun. Okay. Okay. For the gun. Oh. Sam, where do you stand on salty licorice? Oh. Let, let, let's roll that back. Where do you stand on licorice? Oh, I cannot stand licorice. Ah. <laughs> you see, like, I... 
because it's just a really strong flavor. Like, I can have a little bit of licorice, but I need to, like, I can't, like, chew a great big chunk of it. I can't eat, like, a whole licorice wall, so I've got to, like, nibble at it. Yes. And then it's kind of nice. I know um, that the licorice lovers out there are going to really hate me for it. I'm I'm aware, Yan. <laughs> But but uh, uh, 21st century clan makes a good point. Why not make it worse with some salt? Would you like some salty in... licorice? That sounds like an innuendo. <laughs> in all fairness, right, I have tried um, salted licorice. Um, I would say um, it is improved for being salted. Ah. Um, I think there's... Uh, it isn't for me, like, eating licorice, but, like... I, I can certainly see the appeal of, of the salt with the licorice. It... <laughs> M is suggesting... Um, M is suggesting that we try different varieties of um, licorice on stream. Why? Why would we do that? Oh god! I know that's that's like a whole genre of uh, content. That's true. It's try snacks and you know react in the moment. It's very popular. Yeah, no. Salt works really well with uh, sweet things. Like salted caramel, very good. Um, my favourite kind of milkshake, salted honey, um, just mm. very good. Oh, you know what? I've had that. Is yeah. that the one you make? That's yeah. really good. Sam makes a great milkshake. I know, everyone, that this game is set in a capitalist dystopia, and I know why. Because we got paid a lot of money for killing people but we didn't get paid for this on the job training we just did <laughs> do you know what i mean like we came to work we did the training and did we get paid no that was on our own time apparently <laughs> um are you not gonna keep the charge up gun oh I'll, I'll, I'll give it a shot I, I i just love it as a concept i think it's good but um... wait no I can't. I can't tell whether Cavaland is joking. I feel like Cavaland must be joking. Cavaland has said that a licorice brand where they're from is spunk. That seems like a joke, <laughs> but I am very. We, we in spend... fairness, I am very credulous. And like Cavaland, you saying it's a real brand doesn't. No, no. <laughs> Am I going to look up I, on my phone spunk licorice and have I, that as something the algorithm knows I've looked? For? I am inclined to believe them because they mentioned it before when I was playing uh, Invisible Ink, and we were oh. very much laughing about um, the the idea of eating spunk. Um, <laughs> oh. Yeah, you know what? I think I am going to look it up. <laughs> You're correct, Kavlin. I am going to look it up. Okay. You just can't resist. It's, I, I it's can't, such an intriguing concept. I, I cannot resist the spunk licorice. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's real. Um, I kind of like the box design. Wait. I'm sorry. <laughs> it does look like <laughs> it does look like a packet of cigarettes with just the cutest abstract parrot on the front. Wait, what? Oh, that's a packet of cigarettes yeah. with a really abstract parrot with yeah. just these gorgeous, um, gorgeous eyelashed eyes on it. It's it's really expressive. Um. um uh, Jan says they looked it up, but <laughs> DuckDuckGo <laughs> auto-censored all the images. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Um, <laughs> oh my god. Um, I I put I cannot speak for Sam, but um, if you would like to send us the spunk licorice, I will try the spunk licorice on stream. <laughs> I'm not afraid. I'm uh, not a coward. I I I. I Sam's not a coward either. I know you're not a coward. Didn't say I wouldn't, but like... <laughs> oh. Oh. The M. Cavalans, you guys are incredible. Yeah, no, like, if that happens, 100%, we will try some other... Well, I, I, I don't want to speak for Sam, but I definitely will. Um... We found the trees, though, right? There's oh, so yeah, many we of found them. Trees. This is a great log. Let's hunt. go logging. <laughs> log, log, log. I, I, I love so much that it's not even like you're knocking down the trees. You just get close to the trees, and the trees just, the trees just die. <laughs> they just go. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Should watch out for those. Yeah, those Jesus. launchers. My. Yeah, we are definitely the fucking bad guys. Right? Yeah, um, these guys are just trying to live their lives. Oh, yeah, this is their planet. They're the ones who live here. Like, we are a uh, mercenary. Um, we're just working for, like, invading corporations. <laughs> it's it's kind of fucked. <laughs> Also on the subject of weird, because uh, Chad's talking about like what's what's the weird candy where you're from, you know? What would you say the weirdest candy that we have here is, or like the weirdest? Let's branch out a bit, like the weirdest kind of snacky delicacy. Um. Obviously, pig's trot. <laughs> <No>, um, <laughs> yeah, that's not really a snack, though, you know? See how long we could ignore that. <laughs> I'm, I am enjoying this gun. I don't know how satisfying it is to play. It, it's pretty satisfying it's, uh, to use. Now, see. Oh, toxic waste candy. That that is unusual. Um, toxic waste isn't bad. Um, I, I, I've got to like give a handout to um. Marvelous Creations Cadbury's Chocolate. Oh, that is weird, yeah. Uh, so it's chocolate with uh, popping candy in it and jelly sweets. It's very, it's yeah. very odd. Um, yeah, it is more other stuff than chocolates at that point. It's not more other yeah, stuff. Than it's it's chocolate, it's but it's close on that, but it's really not, it shouldn't it should not be nice, and it is. Um, for me, and I don't know how easy it would be able it would be to find now, but so you know, like Gumball, oh, YouTube. Oh, 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 fuck. Um. Pretty sure that Walter told you to ignore it. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Yeah, and but what a cool why, way to die! I was so close. I, I was really close. <laughs> <sighs> right. Let's give it a shot. I, I reckon I can get it. Uh, M, the uh, Studenska is so. 
the name rings a bell, but I don't remember. I don't remember chocolate with jelly specifically. Um. So maybe not, or maybe there's more than one variety. Um. Haviland saying milk bottles, like milk bottle chews. That's that's a weird delicacy, I would say. Um. Wait, do people not have their mother places? Oh, it would be—it would surprise me. But they are—I will say—they are a bit weird. Um, bursting bugs. Bursting bugs. Bursting bugs. Like you can't buy them anymore, but they are—they were fruit chews that looked like bugs, and then they had like gooey blood inside them, basically. Like so, you bite them, and the blood would squirt out in your mouth. But they were kind of ghoulish and fun. Um, I miss bursting bugs. <laughs> uh, 21st Century Clown confirms milk bottles. Milk bottles exist in the outside world. They're not a collective dream we're having in Britain. Um... <laughs> yeah, and what do Dickmans make? Uh, Dickmans? Obviously. Oh my god! <laughs> Oh, 21st Century Clown. Just answering. Well, I'm asking, yeah, what, what Dickman's on. Very question, guys. Like, how do you think babies are made? <laughs> Funnier than I will ever be. Right. Okay. M's M's suggesting as an alternative to uh, to sending a care package of snacks um, is just coming to Scotland with a full luggage full of snacks. <laughs> but M, last time you sent us so much stuff that I feel like if you brought that amount of stuff in the luggage, you're basically importing goods. <laughs> <laughs> you know. <laughs> Oh, oh wow. wow. Yeah. God, these, these death animations are impressive, aren't they? Yeah, he took me out in a real hurry. I I think I can take him though. I think I can take him. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're gonna have to, because that's that's clearly what happens in this game. Um Oh, we oh, get it. Ooh, what's, oh, what's happening oh, here? Oh. Hey, this, oh there we go. It's it's, it's fixed. Just the world glitch for a bit. Okay, so Dickman's, as beautifully described by by Yan Sam, a communion wafer. Picture a communion wafer, stable milk sugar, cover it in chocolate. Sorry. Oh, it's chocolate kisses. Oh, like it's chocolate kisses. Hershey's kisses. I've never quite figured out what they are. Aren't they just Transport chopper chunks down. of chocolate? Keep at it, 61. Oh. Nice dodge. That didn't get you at all, did it? It, oh, it got me a little bit. I have to say there is... 
there is more tactical depth to this than I was led to. Oh, that guy just came to see you, huh? Okay, so the, the weird candy I was going to say, which I remember from my childhood, was, uh, you know, you know, gumballs where, like, you know, they're, they're a ball, you suck them until they go soft, and then they're bubblegum in the middle, right? Yeah. And they're, like, fruit-flavored or color-flavored or whatever. Like, I remember one which was, like, cinnamon-flavored, but, like, so cinnamon that it was actually, like, painful in your mouth. Oh, um, yeah. Um, and it would make some people just vomit. I think that was um, Fireballs? Yeah, those are the ones. Um, see, that's a weird sweet. What you made me made me think of um, weird sweets from childhood are uh, beer-flavored cola bottles. Ew. Beer bottles. Um, Horrifying. They, they were sweets that were beer-flavored. <laughs> and were sweets as well? Yeah. That's the worst. They, they didn't taste much like beer, but, like, I guess when when you were a kid, it felt like being grown up. <laughs> <laughs> or, like, chocolate cigarettes. They used to have chocolate cigarettes, like, when we were kids. Like, they, oh, yeah. there's no way they have them We were talking now. about this before, but, yeah. Um, but, like, yeah, uh, candy cigarettes, um... Because there's also the sort of really chalky kind of oh, yeah, cigarette that, sweet. Yeah, I loved those. I loved those as a kid. Um, Laura likes sugar babies and sugar daddies? That doesn't sound real. I think that might be jelly babies, right? That sounds jelly baby-ish. Oh, can you... Wait... I mean, I don't want to. I don't want to hear like, I don't want to see something and then just immediately shut down. Like, oh, you're making that up because <laughs> there, there are clearly like no bounds to how weird sweets can get. Um, but there's, let's just say there's things that I really hope are real, but I'm going like, <laughs> I'm just surprised to see. M, you should 100% come to Scotland. It is beautiful here. Oh! Dib dabs! Dib dabs. Dib dabs are pretty good. Uh, the swizzle stick. I got it! Oh. You did! Oh, are these just oh. AFK? Dad called me, <laughs> called me a natural. How exciting! You've is adopted that? Walter as your dad. I mean, what? <laughs> right. Okay. 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 Laura Lai has mentioned. Um, something which i i genuinely didn't think was real so apparently love hearts in the u.s are called conversation hearts huh and okay i sort of had heard that on like tv shows and thought that was like their like way around copyrights or something but apparently not <laughs> So the conversation hearts, they're not specifically, like, amorous in nature? I don't know. I've, I've never quite figured it out. If, if Are they just there to break the us, ice um, <laughs> at parties? <laughs> but if you're wondering, we can still get love hearts here. So um, are you getting weird sound things? I am. Oh. Um, but I think um, I've got a loose connection, in fact, on my, uh, on my jack. It's not. It's not that big an issue. It's not that big an issue, Sam. Um, unless anyone else is getting weird sounds popping in and out, but I don't. I think it's a me problem. 
Right, okay. I might need to... Is that better on your end? I don't notice the difference, but it's it's fine. Okay. Oh, honestly, it is fine. I might um, need to look at that um, connector we've got, because I was getting that the other week, so... Okay. But that's fine. That's fair. Like, yeah, I'll just keep an eye on it. And... Oh, we've we got to keep the rig right, everyone. Ooh. Because we could get more missiles. You could always get more missiles. But we'd have to spend some time colouring them in. We would have <laughs> to spend some time colouring them in. Um, right. I'm really close to getting like a... <laughs> the chonky. I could, I could go chonky. <laughs> or I could go like less chonky but still no I like the chonky because like if you look he's got like go back to the chonky this guy's got really bad posture compared to yeah, this guy I like, agree I agree <laughs> sorry the um, chonky if you, if you go if you go to the chonky he's just got he's just got nips you know oh or 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 if you yeah, just ignore the nips. fact that you've got a that if you ignore the fact that the mecha has a head he just looks like a little frog you know oh you yeah see the little frog face yeah no i see that um, pez pez is a weird concept pez it's just is so weird. it's just so disposable and such a massive hunk of plastic to sell it with um yeah pez is weird um do people still like obsessively buy pez dispensers is that still a thing oh someone's got to because um, I know there used to be like massive collectors of Pez um, collecting thousands of um, Pez dispensers. <laughs> Got a job for you, 621. It's an open call for <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> like, the you gimmick with Pez dispensers, dispensers is you eat candy out of the neck of your favorite character. Dafung, yep, but mm, like, who, who among us cannot say that we haven't wanted to eat it? I can, I can, I can say that. No, really, if you got the chance, wouldn't you eat candy out of Jojo's neck? <laughs> you saying that Jojo is my favorite character? Fuck you. <laughs> also, which one? There's like 12. Um... I want to say uh, Joe. Steamboat, that confection you just described is... Uh, sounds so good. That gingerbread and jam Maybe thing, that sounds simple, amazing. I don't want to let that pass. Um, Stay sharp, yeah, I, I, I enjoy JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. I enjoy, um, I enjoy Diamond is Unbreakable. Um, I like that arc. That is... So much fun. I like the weird small town Twin Peaks vibe of that particular uh, that particular phase of JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. It's it's good stuff. Main system activating combat mode. I still can't get over how good we look. We've got a read on the target. It's <laughs> so good. I love it so much. <laughs> Uh, Sam, M is asking, do you have any any favorite media or fandoms? Um. <laughs> there is a purpose to this. <laughs> There's a purpose to There's this. There's a purpose to oh. this. M's going, oh, to okay. a, M's going to a con, I think. Um. Because <laughs> I, can, I can be real awkward here. Um, you know, one that's always going to be always going to be in my heart is M.A.S.H. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> of course it's M.A.S.H. Sure you can. Two repair kits remaining. Uh, Sam and I have a uh, have a comedian we like. Um, 
His name is John Robertson, and he starts <laughs> every show um, by asking asking the audience which decade they're born. It's like, oh, and if you're born in the 50s, give me a cheer. Um, born in the, you know, all the way up to like the 2010s, you know. Um, but I think the I think the 50s generation. Um, Generally, there are fewer people in the audience and the cheer is a little less enthusiastic. And his comeback to that tends to be something along the lines that, yeah, you're still just heartbroken but mash ended. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sam, M doesn't think that mash merch is a thing. Oh, is oh, so... <laughs> you haven't seen how weirdly prolific the MASH fandom is on <laughs> Tumblr, huh? Um, because... Boy... Um, I, I have not either, to be fair. Look, like, I'm just saying... Because I do not have that affinity with MASH that you do. For, for, I think it's good. For a show that ended 50 years ago... <laughs> Literally 50 years ago? No, it ended in about 79. Um, <laughs> rip. Did you steal a helicopter? Maybe. I completely lost track of what, what you were doing. <laughs> I was Oh I was I was so excited about <laughs> just everything going on in chat. <laughs> um I'm trying to think what what Well, well, well. Hey, you're like an Assassin's Creed. I would say you're in the Assassin's Creed fan. I'm surprised you'd even dare to call. See, I like the games, but proposal. I'm not sure I've seen anything okay, from outside of the game, <laughs> yeah. um, um, which is gun. interesting. Gen um, can be emotionally withdrawn. They need a shot in the arm every now and then. You like Columbo? Hey, Everyone me. likes Columbo. Everyone here. likes Columbo. Well, apparently <laughs> not my family. <laughs> we, Your family don't like Columbo? I... I, I almost them. got into a fight Divorce with them. some of my family <laughs> on on um, <laughs> with some of my family on holiday because they One don't like Columbo. <laughs> um, M wants to find you some stickers. Oh, so just yeah, no. This is this. The, M wants to find you some stickers. So like, name something stickers. that isn't super obscure that M might be able to find <laughs> stickers of at a con. <laughs> like, I'd be very impressed if if you could find um, mash stickers at a local con. Um, yeah. Um, M needs practical advice here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, I just oh boy there's there's a lot of people make really good Dark Souls art oh like, thank god um, <laughs> you're being threatened with biblically accurate chickens why would I not want biblically accurate <laughs> chickens oh my god um, I can tell you in the interest of giving you a straight answer, look, I'm looking right into the camera now. Um, Sam really likes the character Solaire from Dark Souls 1. Oh, yeah, I do. Um, I do. Um. <gasps> the biblically accurate chicken is the Okuku from Twilight Princess. <laughs> that is so true. Um, um, I, yeah. <laughs> I, I am also a massive uh, fan of Pokemon. Um, so... <laughs> Uh, oh shit! I, yeah, I, I really love a magic up. Yeah. So, really love a magic up. Uh, <laughs> so, <laughs> um, I also like a, um, a Pokemon accurate chicken. Um, <laughs> oh my! My audio cut out completely there for a second. That was fun. <laughs> um, Pokemon accurate chicken. Biblically accurate Pokemon. Uh. Right. You do have a lot of you have a you have a Diso Magikarp plushie. 
Do you want me to? Do you want me to? Because I can see it right now. Do you want yeah, me to fetch that? No. Hold on. It's it's so cute. Oh hell yeah! Let's get chonky. Um, chonky boys. So this is this is a ditto that is currently a magic up. Um, yeah. Oh yeah. You can reach the camera. Right. I I think it'll be easier to see if we go to this camera and hey. we get into the zoom zone. <laughs> Woo! Oh. Look at that's just a happy little boy. He's he's just a little guy. <laughs> um Oh sorry, I was I was trying to mouse over to the to the chat. Um we need to set up your phone so I can keep a better eye on chat, I think, next week. Um yes. Yeah. We just we have a very small chat window on our monitor. Um and basically if it's like more than five five posts ago I can't see it. <laughs> Yeah, I need to come up with a better solution. But <laughs> I mean, bas basically, basically, we need a tablet. We need, we need to find. We need to find like the cheapest. Yeah. Um... <laughs> we need to find a cheap ass tablet, and oh. we need to have it open. He's chunky. He's chunky. He's chunky. Um, You're saying the biblical sheep had badonkadonk asses? <laughs> oh, oh, Dark Souls and Pokemon, but what about just as a concept for um, for fan art? Like, if I were a good artist, I would draw this, but Dark Soulkimon. <laughs> You know, oh. just just Pokemon that you have given the Dark Souls aesthetic, like still cutesy, but you know, um, they are they are accursed undead. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. doomed to no, usher in an good. era of darkness. Like, <laughs> you know, if I, if I I can kind of draw, but like not super well. Raven, um, this request comes from Schneider, an archivist subsidiary. The mission will take place in the Bonadea dunes of Western Velius. Oh, yeah, I know Our what those are, obviously. Our coral investigation there is being blocked by the Strider, a Rubicon Liberation Front mining oh, ship. Oh, they were talking about the Strider you before. to destroy it. The Strider is a mobile resource base that was extensively weaponized by the Liberation Front. Call it the crowning glory of their efforts I to militarize I cannot tell how big this is going to be. Oh, massive. You know it's going to be massive. It's got to be massive, right? Laser cannon connected directly to the main uh, Sam, we are at two minutes to nine. Do you want to call this our last sortie? Yeah. This mission. Yeah. Right, live or die. We're going to scramble. Um, and we'll see what happens. Cavalin is saying that the Ditto Carp is two flesh colors. Smash the Strider. And <laughs> HQ will be sure to uh, to be name. fair, we, we we have quite bright lights here um, to to sort of make us look a bit better uh, on camera. So it, it it's not very flesh colored in person. It is more. Incidentally, uh, Laurie noted. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks for letting us know. Just get through all this dust. There's a lot of dust to get through, in fairness. <gasps> oh, I love that visual effect. Oh, oh, look at that. That is gorgeous. Apparently, we should abide with Rubicon. Oh, and it's just so deceptively I'm not disagreeing. far away. This is so holy crap. Oh my god. Are we gonna blow that up? 
I think we've I got to blow this up. I want to be friends with it. Um, All right, now you're up close and personal. Take out one of its legs and bring it to a halt. Fuck. Oh my god, this is... Oh, yeah, this is scale. cool. Oh man, they really shouldn't have left those bits exposed though, huh? It's just schoolboy error. Rookie mistake. Rookie mistake. Yeah, it is just metallic shadow of the Colossus. Kinda love that. Is this gonna fall down on me? I mean... If it did, what a way to go. Right. So I wouldn't even run. Confirmed. Strider leg compromised. Oh, yeah, no, it's going down. <laughs> the bigger they are, the harder they fall. Oh, it's got a lot of health still. Ho, ho, ho. Whoa. Wow. I think that could have fallen on you, actually. Right? All right now I feel like that could have fallen on me. Um, Grab on and get to work on the sub -channel. I like that it falling also took damage off it, not just the damage to the leg. Yeah. So this is what, like it's an un a coral mining ship? I think this is one of their, like, main resource ships. Or okay. Main, like, so it's definitely resource got drills slash and fighting ship. Oh, you don't want to miss that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, Laurie, you were oh, so right. <laughs> this is just... Yeah, this is Shadow of the Colossus. Oh! Oh! Ho, 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 ho. Oh. Uh, I think you got their attention. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <gasps> oh my there god. You go. Ace pilot right here. Okay. Okay. I made it somewhere. I've got to get around there to destroy that. Um, I guess I'm going here. Are you just. Well. Where am I? No, because you're how now you're I? pointed away from it. Oh, right. How so am I like, turn, there? turn, turn around. Can you not go up those right around? Um, can you not just climb up there? Yeah, but there's one here. Uh, but I uh, think I have to destroy it from the right direction, and I think that's over there. Okay. And I want to make. Oh, just try it. You know. Let's give it a yeah. shot. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. Destroyed. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad someone made the uh, Divine Beast joke. Yeah, this is definitely, um, yeah, uh, Vanaboris, isn't it? Yeah, you know? no. I think it's Varnivorous. I forget I forget the exact names. But that sounds right. Right, I'm back here. Let's try not to get lasered this time. Um Yeah, just up oh, 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 oh shit. Right. Yeah. You got this. Okay, so just don't stick your head around that big bulkhead um, like you're doing right now. <laughs> yeah, but I think... Okay, get moving. 
I still think we can beat him first try. Come on. Oh boy. Uh, does that kill what? me? It okay. does kill you. Oh my God. Okay, okay. It it got rid oh, of no, some no, health. Oh no, it just resets you. It reset okay. me. So okay. that's, that's uh, okay. So it's like I Zelda, actually. <laughs> you fall off a big thing in Zelda. It just takes some health off and resets you. Oh yeah, you don't oh. really say. You don't even need to come out of cover to take that down. Wait. Shit. Uh, Did you press the hit it with your sword button? Yeah. <laughs> Just one left. Shit. Okay, it's another one of these where I have to peek out. But that's okay. Once that's done. I, I have a question. Yeah. Which is the radio chatter from the guys you're fighting are like, uh, hold the line, defend the ship with your lives. But like, there's no one defending the ship apart from these automated guns, right? Yeah. There are no fighters or helicopters or mecha defending it. Just... Shit. And it's, it's putting up a good fight, but... So I've got a question for chat. What's your favourite divine beast? Uh, since we're talking about Naboris. Okay. Right. Because Naboris is up there, but I do like Rudania. I think mine might be Meadow. Yeah, I just I just love the tilt aspects of that. Now you've got the oh, there we sights. go. Time to finish this Shit. Oh. Yeah, Rud Rudania. Rudania is a good fight. You were nearly there. We're going to get it. Oh, I've got a checkpoint. Can I give it one more shot? I'm giving it one more shot. I, Sorry. Yeah, I think you give it one more <laughs> shot. Oh. I think the boss fight I like the most um, is the... Uh, is the Mado... Ganon boss fight, like I just love I love using the currents the currents to attack. Um, and I really like I really like all the rematches in the expansion. Where they limit the uh, they limit the supplies you've got. I think that's really fun. This is why we got the chunky body, just to just to tank that whilst we hit it with a sword. We're not through yet. Show right? One sec, let me Oh shit. Where am I? Where am I? Okay. You're fine, you're okay. fine. I feel like walking directly into the beam and hitting with the sword is not not necessarily the intended route, but it's not not working. Right? Oh, the Talises and Tears of the Kingdom are like, yeah. Oh. 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 That feels oh. like I need to get the fuck out of here. Uh, no, not towards it. Oh boy. Man, you just ruined these people's day. I really. 
Oh yeah, you go. You gotta get out of here. Uh, where do I go? Uh, where do uh, I yeah, go? Just jump off. Jump off. Do I just jump, jump off? Yeah, just jump off. <laughs> You're flying towards it again. Why are you flying towards it? See, I feel quite sad. I think we blew up something really cool. That. And if we had just repainted it, it cool. could have been even cooler. <laughs> <laughs> it maybe put some leopard prints on it. Right? Yeah. Oh, man. Why don't just, we just have leopard prints? Yeah. Oh. Or maybe we have to pay for the leopard prints. Right. Or maybe it's the leopard print DLC. It is like killing a unique thing. <laughs> like, yeah, no, 21st Century Clown is totally right. There's a, there's a, there's a sadness to this. But also, man, I feel awesome. <laughs> work on the Strider deserves commendation. I am thrilled to have issued you the request. Allow me to introduce myself. Stop trying to take the, the credit. You didn't do anything. <laughs> At your service. His name is V8 Pater. Is he a robot? Maybe. It's okay for him to be a robot. I just. Huh. Cool. Well, I think that is us for a week. Yeah. Hey. This game has robots. This game does. This have game robots. has a lot of robots. I mean, fewer this robots than has it has because you blew up a lot of robots. I blew up a like, lot of robots. But luckily, the, the robots seem to be in plentiful supply to blow up, so, you know. Yeah. <laughs> um, well, thanks very much, everyone, for joining us. This has been really fun. I yeah. am really glad I chose to stream this game. <laughs> um, we will be back next week. Um, same same time, probably the same time. I don't remember when the clocks go back. I don't think that's till uh, later. Not not till not um, till uh, mid October. I don't think. So okay, we got, we got a little while. Um, um, yeah, we will be back same time, same place next week. Um, in the meantime, if you want to catch up, uh, last week uh, we uh, put out a special episode because we couldn't be here on Twitch over on our YouTube. Uh, that's youtube.com slash at Kofi Um So you can go and find that there. Um, you can follow us over on Twitter at Kofi Assam, And you can that follow me on Twitter at Corfidius. And you can follow me over on Tumblr at Assam Kofi. We need to start throwing these up because we're, we're like explaining like six different places to go <laughs> at this point. You can find me oh. at Neither a Baron everywhere. Except Insta. I need to get an Insta. Um, and yeah um, so yes uh, if you want to go and sit on the username neither a baron <laughs> over <laughs> on instant gramophone then <laughs> no <laughs> do not do that okay but I you mean... should have secured your brand just saying just saying stop it stop <laughs> it I <laughs> I have had so many headaches in the last <laughs> in the last forty eight hours. I do not need another one. Please don't do that. <laughs> anyway, um, if if you want to help Kofi out, <laughs> stop them having quite so many headaches. You can go over to their um, over to their. Um, I was about to say OnlyFans, and that's not what that is. I don't uh, have an OnlyFans. Their, but maybe I should branch out. Uh, their coffee <laughs> at ko fi um, dot dot com dot com dot okay. com slash Kofi Young. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, it has been a very long day. It has been a uh, very long day, and you may have you may have detected mechanisms, fans. I have had a very busy forty-eight hours of intense logistics. 
um, in a good way. Yeah. Um, um, uh, Kavanaugh is saying we need to make we need to make uh, we need to make a uh, we need to make a can ASMR channel. We, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, we have we have a, a coffee. We we do. We have a coffee dot like, com slash coffee a Sam. <laughs> yeah. We don't offer much on that. We don't offer anything on there, but like it's a place to go. It's, it's a place it's to a, go, I guess. Um, <laughs> and yeah, uh, we we need to check it because um, M has M has donated. Oh, um, then I I oh wow yeah thanks very much. <laughs> I, um, yeah, we will check that out. I'm sure we will um, probably give you a proper shout out once we have actually seen it <laughs> next next week but, oh <laughs> boy so many places um, to check oh my god um, yeah. um in the meantime it has been an absolute pleasure go do something nice for someone else or yourself um and we will see you the next time we see you all right take care guys see you next time